This is an instructional video on how to use our ballistic calculator, TraceAll. We'll launch the application now. TraceAll was developed in collaboration between Desert Tech and Sniper's Hide. You can see at the bottom of the screen there are three main categories, our ballistics, equipment, and settings. <clears throat> We're going to go through the settings tab first. At the top you have a way to name your user profile. I'm going to name mine my initials N-E-Y. I can also put my email address in there. Below that are all of the setting, default settings that I can set that will flow into the equipment and ballistic screens. So the first section is for bullet data. Our BC units is the ballistic coefficient. I can have the default be G7 or G1 drag curves. I'm going to select G7 for high uh, ballistic coefficient boat tail bullets. The next one is bullet weight. We have the option of grains or grams followed by muzzle velocity units. That's the speed of the projectile. That's feet per second or meters per second. Below that is the sighting units, which is the scope adjustment values for elevation and windage. Turret allows you to account for any click value error. MRAD or MILS is another option. MOA and IFE, which is inches at 100 yards, followed by, or I like to have mine set at turret to account for any kind of click value error, uh, which gives me a much more precise prediction. Uh, below that is range units, which is yards or meters. Below that is angle slope, which is uh, the orientation of the rifle uh, slope and that's in degrees or cosine. I use degrees in my angle indicator. <coughs> uh, below that is the speed units for moving targets and wind direction. Uh, I use uh, miles per hour for my setting. And then we have the angle for the wind or the moving target and I prefer clock. Uh, the length units is the units of measure for the projectile's uh, dimensions, and I prefer inches. Uh, energy units is for the energy of the bullet, and I prefer foot-pounds. <coughs> Altitude units is the unit of measure above sea level. Uh, you select feet or meters. Uh, pressure units and uh, temperature units. Uh, Fahrenheit or Celsius. Uh, below that you have the ability to enable or disable uh, Coriolis and Spindrift which are advanced uh, features to in, uh, improve your precision of your prediction. You can toggle those on or off. They default to on and we suggest that you uh, to you leave these activated and uh, learn to utilize the instrumentation to uh, input the information for those to get the most precise prediction possible. <coughs> Next we have the table selection options. Uh, we can change the maximum distance that we want the table to end at. Uh, the program is limited currently at 3,500 meters or 3,500 yards. So if I try to enter a value above 3,500 yards, it will default back to 3,500. Uh, the range increments is the distance between each number on the table, and I prefer uh, 25 yard increments uh, for my table. The set all feature allows me to set the entire table to either metric or English units. Um, and I prefer English. Uh, the what's on screen allows us to see the advanced features and which ones are being utilized. 
as you enter information in the ballistics screen, it will automatically enable uh, advanced features that utilize that information. And you can come to this screen and see which ones are activated and um, being accounted for in your solution. <coughs> This automatic activation of these advanced features is uh, uh, very convenient for and simplifies the use of the program uh, significantly. A stability factor at the bottom here has uh, is uh, the bullet uh, stability to ensure you don't have any issues with uh, tumbling as you approach the uh, subsonic realm of the bullet's flight. <coughs> we can go ahead and save this profile. As we save this we find that I already have a profile that says NEY so I can actually either have this be a different profile name maybe I can put NEY2 or I can also put NEY1 and have it replace the previous uh, NEY1 profile. Yes I'll overwrite. <coughs> That con concludes the uh, use of the settings screen. We will next move on to the uh, equipment screen.